Yo guys, welcome back to a brand new PCGO Vivid Voltage video. Today, guys, we're looking at a really cool uh, Leon Zard Breaksar deck here. Um, this was a deck that I played against in one of my past videos. I think it was the Porygon Z Pertriode video. And I really like the idea, so I'm going to leave a little shout out here to the person who created the deck um, on screen with an image. But this is a really cool deck. Um, the idea of using Breaksard with Charizard is really cool because it's already a dual Charizard deck, which is already a really cool concept to begin with. And of course, Breaksard, Brilliant Flare, we can try to get three cards in our hand, try to build up multiple Charizards, or use Brilliant Flare to establish like more game plans with Leon. So really cool combo here. Really like this deck. The only real like Achilles heel you'll ever get with Breaksard is that it does, of course, get Marnied. And that is pretty problematic. Most decks play Marnie, but... If you play against a Wilder deck, it's not as bad. Um, but Marnie can be disruptive of this deck. But you can play really smart around the Marnie. I and mean, of course, you can use Leon Zard here. Royal Blaze can do up to 300 damage with four Leon in your discard pile. So really cool combo. Really like the deck. Uh, this is the list that I use for today's video. Honestly, looking back, it's not a perfect list. I definitely want to make some changes. Um, but this is what I played with the video, and it was pretty cool. So, frankly, the video guys, course, share too with the sponsor, Car Cabin TCG. As always, guys, if you're ever looking for any PDCGO pack codes, uh, get them over at Car Cabin, guys. Car Cabin does sell PDCGO codes online for the cheapest. So, if you guys are looking for any vivid voltage codes, or if you're looking for any other set codes like Darts of Blaze, Sword and Shields, Rebel Clash, get them over at Car Cabin. Or if you're looking for a specific GXV promo code, sleeve code, whatever, like the Dedenne Trune Toolkit, or if you want to get that ADP Zation Battle Kit code, get them over at Car Cabin, guys. If you get any codes at Car Cabin TCG, make sure you use my discount code, code LDF, for a 5% discount on your purchase at the checkout to help the channel, help yourself out, and help out Car Cabin. So shout out to Car Cabin, guys. Check them out and use code LDF if you get any codes. All right, let's look at the list. So this is what I have came up with here. Um, I wasn't able to get the actual list from the video, but this is kind of what I constructed I know my opponent's list had like Mew and stuff. I'm not playing Mew in here. We're just going straight forward. Breakzard is a kind of a cool card. Um, it's not as good as Reshizard because it doesn't do enough damage to knock out Bolt Hunt like Reshizard does. It also can't one-shot Pika as easily. But it does have Brilliant Flare, which gets you three cards. Um, the main reason why this card, I think, will never really work that well is, of course, Marnie is really, really powerful um, against this card. It's a bit of a detriment to this card's potential to work, but I do think that... Um, if you don't get Marnie, this card can be really strong with Charizard, and combining two different Charizard cards together like this, it's just an awesome deck. At this point, I might as well make the ultimate Charizard deck. At this point, I'm going to make a video on Reshizard, Breakzard, Leonzard, Team Up, Zard, all in one deck, just for the memes. Um, but yeah, the first game I actually got was against another cool Leonzard deck. So the first game was actually really exciting. Um, I didn't really play the first game as well as I wanted to, but the first game was just really cool. Like, I really like, <laughs> the first game was just awesome, so I wanted to keep it. Um, but it's the list I'm playing. I'm playing Volk, of course, to get three energy on Breaksard. Breaksard does need four energy to attack, which can be a bit of an issue because that means you can't attack turn one because you can't go attach Welder. But, you know, and attack, you have to go attach Welder, then the following turn attack. And then I got Dedenne Crobat, Lele. Pretty simple stuff. Uh, Lele, sorry, Eldegoss. Um, keep thinking it's the old days. Um, I am playing Crystal since, you know, a lot of energy. I am also playing 11 energy to go with it, plus 3 Giant Harf, so pretty good energy count. There's no Orny Rod in the deck, which I'm not going to play. I am playing a Great Catcher. This was a clutch card because it was able to help me out against some matchups, but being able to use Great Catcher to help get rid of Leon or Great Catcher Welder in the same turn is really powerful. Um, and I got two boss also in the deck. Um, for Poke Gear, really like Poke Gear in here since we are not playing like anything insane. No Jirachi with Stellar Wish. We're going to play Poke Gear to try to find our Welders and stuff like that. I got four quick balls. I know there's no calm in this deck. I kind of forgot about calm. Um, but yeah, I definitely want to play a couple comms in this deck for sure. You guys can find room. Definitely, you should add a few comms. I got three candies. I'm not playing four because I am playing two Charmeleon. You can cut a Charmeleon for Charizard. But there's actually going to be times where rare candy is just not a good card to have. Um, because it's just going to... It's a dead card a lot of the time if you don't you know, have a Charizard combo. And I don't like playing three candies. Not to mention, we don't need to... A lot of the time, we actually don't need four Charizards per game. Because obviously, a Breakstar gets knocked out. That's three prizes. So... You don't need to put four Charizards in play a lot of the time, so <laughs> I don't think we need four Rare Candy. Plus, I have the two Charmeleon. Sometimes you can also go Rare Candy Charizard off of the Brilliant Flare, and then your opponent Marnies them to the bottom of the deck. So having the extra Charmeleon can help counteract the outs to your opponent, you know, Marnieing away your hand. Because if you get Marnied, you have to then get Rare Candy and Charizard, but if you get Marnied into a Charmeleon, it still helps you get to the Charizard, if that makes any sense. Um, I am playing a reset stamp. Uh, you can actually put your opponent down to low hand sizes with breaks are going, giving up three prizes. Your opponent maybe knocks out a Dene, then that's five prizes, and then you can stamp the one, or you can go, they knock out Charizard, they knock out Leon Zard, you can stamp the two. Uh, two switch, you know, pretty simple stuff. I'm playing some air balloons in here to help retreat. Giving Breaksard a Wonder Tree cost could be good. Once Breaksard done its thing, you can actually put it to the bench 
and then just attack with Charizard, which can be a combo you can try to accomplish. Plus, it, you know, lets you go into Volcanion. Then I got 11 Fire Energy around the list. Yeah, it's my list. I like it a lot. It's a lot of fun to play. Um, let's go try it out. Shout out to the person who made it. Really cool deck. And let's see if this deck is any good. All right, guys, let's try out this Charizard deck here. I'm pretty excited to play it because I did kind of get Body Bite. I think we are going to go second here. Try to get that turn one flare starter off our turn one welder. Ooh, we got the break sard. We do have a gear that could maybe find us a uh oh, what's what do you what the uh the welder. Ooh. I think it's a Charizard V Max. So it's a battle of the Charizard decks. I'm playing Breaksard Charizard Leon. We're playing it's a Charizard V Max deck. The only thing missing from this matchup is Detective Pikachu Charizard and the team up Charizard. It would have been all out Charizard War. Hmm. Uh, I don't really like giving them the uh, the giant hearth here, but we got to do it because we need to find welder. If we don't get welder, it ain't looking pretty, chief, which we don't get. Of course not. Ugh, no, dude, not like this, bro. Ah, and I just gave him a free welder to work with. Or, yeah, free giant hearth. Not like this. I guess we could have went for... Nah, we can do crimson flame pillar, I guess, next turn. That can push us to a brilliant flare... But oh, they got Leon too. Well, they're playing a Charizard V Max Leon deck, right? So it doesn't matter. I might do a video on Charizard V Max Leon, by the way. I thought of that, and I was like, yeah, that might actually work. You know, Leon makes Charizard V Max do 330 damage, pushes it above. As long as I don't have a Welder here, we're chilling. All right, nice. This is what we need. Uh, there we go. We drew a Dedenne. Did draw the Dedenne, so we're just gonna Dedenne change. I'm not gonna bother attaching the energy. Because uh, we probably do our GX tech here, which yeah, looks like we are able to successfully do. Yo, can we get a Leon? We got a boss. Do we need the boss? That's our last boss. I think we just take the welder. We could just do uh, our GX tech here, which I think is fine. We can get three energy on the active. We can welder to the bench. Yeah, that's fine. We could put, I guess we could put three on the active in case we get knocked out. Which, I mean, I doubt that'll happen. I doubt we're going to get knocked out. Next turn, we can actually just boss out the, the Charizard V and hit it for 180 and then get, like, two rare candy Charizard. Or we can get Leon or something, too, which I think is fine. Hopefully, we can get a Leon off this Pogear next turn so we can then Giant Hearth it away again. We could also just knock out the active... They could also bench into Dene, because, like, at the end of the day, we're going to be... Okay, they actually Bird Keeper, which is fine. It does give them three free cards to work with, so they should be able to get a better setup here, I'm assuming. Because the thing with Charizard VMAX is we can already knock it out. It's got, what, 330 HP? As long as we keep one Leon in the deck, we can always knock it out with Charizard. As long as they also don't play Heat Energy or Big Charm, which I highly doubt they do. So we can always... I guess they're... Oh, they're going to Claw Slash Fire Spin knock me out. Okay. That's fine. So maybe we do just boss out this other Charizard then and hit it. Yeah, as long as they don't play a, an HP modifier. I, I doubt... They, okay, what are the chances they actually play Reset Stamp or Marnie? I doubt they play Marnie, dude. There's no way, bro. There's no Marnies. There is definitely no Marnie. Who plays Marnie, bro? Okay, there's the Leon. This gives us more routes to winning... We got two Leon left. Do another Poke Gear. Research. Here, we'll take it. I mean, I don't they play Marnie, bro. There's no way they have a Marnie in the deck. <laughs> I'm sorry, there's just no way. Uh, so what do we got? Two Leon on the discards. So we go Charizard, Leon, Leon. Oh, we don't need the Leons, but we can hold it. So we can go Charizard. But well, then we can just research next turn too, right? So we can just go Charizard, Charizard. We need rare candy. I mean, we're we're knocking them out, right? 180. We're already doing 250 damage. And we're doing 200 damage. So we're we're knocking them out already, right? So we can just get rare candy, Charizard, Charizard. Just get some Charizards in play. Now, again, I don't want to think they play Marnie, so I'm hoping they don't play Marnie. I really hope they don't play Marnie here, but like, bro, 
Welder decks do not play Marnie. They shouldn't play Marnie. They can't play Marnie, so. I mean, they have Bird Keeper, but they already have Leon and Bird Keeper. Like, how do they have room for a Marnie? You know, I'm just... They could stand me, I guess, but that's going to still give me six cards, which is still really good. Okay, no Marnie. You love to see it. See, I told you, bro. No one plays Marnie in their Welder decks. It's just a bad card. Uh, it does suck we have to lose our Charizard after one attack. <laughs> I was hoping we could attack this team twice, but we're pretty well set up right now, so it's not really that big of a deal. Oh, there's the VMAX. They have to evolve the bench, though. So we're just going to try to set up a position where we go uh, knockout, right? How much HP? 330. So we can knock it out with with, with the Leon. So we can win the game if, if we do that. So we'll see how it goes. We'll see how it goes. Do they get an energy on the other Charizard? I think they've Welder this turn. So do they have an energy? Quick ball? What? No, dude. What is this, bro? Charizard? Char what, dude? We're all playing Charizard. Oh my god. <laughs> I'm sorry. This is too good. This, this is too gold, bro. This is too gold. I gotta hit him with the you have a good deck, bro. You, you gotta do it. <laughs> oh, that's actually funny. We're both playing Leon. Sorry. Aw, oh, dude. Okay, had I known we were going to draw that, I wouldn't have done that. Alright, we definitely research here, right? It's definitely a research. Alright, here we go. What are we getting? Didn't get any Leons there. Uh... <laughs> this is too good. Alright, we'll do Battle Scent, see if we can find a Leon. Nope, Crystal. Alright, that's 100% going to go on our hands. Actually, I have no energy. We need to find this Leon. Okay, alright. No Leon's there. That's a rip. I'm just gonna have to uh, take a knockout. As long as I get, well, they have one Leon in the discard, so they can't knock me out. They have to go Rare Candy Charizard Leon Welder knock me out. Like they have to do a lot to knock me out. Their hand is massive, but they have to have a lot of stuff they want to knock me out. So yeah, they're just gonna go V Max. They might not even be able to G Max Wild Farm. I mean, they need an Energy and a Triple here. They need a Welder and a Triple, which uh, might actually not be in their hand. We'll see. Yeah, I think they hearth away their heart. So they that's not a Leon discard, which is good. So Yep, there's the welder. They need a triple or oh, I guess they get attached, right? Okay, never mind. They can attach. Well they are down a lot. They're down four seven. They're down eleven energy. They might not even have the knockout here. Well, as long as we get another Charizard in play, we should win the game. We are down one though. Maybe we actually should have just maybe we uh we could welder to the break start, I guess, actually. I guess that works too. But that gives up three prizes. As long as this thing can't, it can't do Welder. I guess they can play Great Catcher. They, they can like Welder, Great Catcher, Charizard, knock out this. But they only have one Leon on the discard still, so it's not a big deal. They need a lot. And yeah, that's not even a Leon discard. We can also just win the game by bossing up Guru. Maybe we should have benched the Volk now, but that only does 110. Alright, I'm overthinking this. We're going to get knocked out. They're going to have the 300 damage my Charizard with their Charizard. It is a Charizard war out here. This is a Charizard war, and I am here for it. So we need to get double Leon to KO them. Ah, I don't like this. Let's see what our top deck is. Twitch. We might even have the Leon in the deck. Maybe we should bench the Breaksart then. I mean, hopefully we do have Leon in the deck. There we go. We can take Stamp. Charmeleon. And yeah, we have Red Candy. We'll take the Stamp. Well, actually, stamping them here is actually really good too. We have one Leon left in the deck. Maybe. I don't even know if it's in the deck, though. I guess we'll check. It is in the deck. So, we have the Welder. We have the Welder and hope it's not the last card in the deck. Fun times. We have the welder and hope it's not the last card. Oh, a joy to the world. All right, here we go. If we don't get it, we probably lose because we'll get. Well, yeah, we lose. We don't get it. Come on, yes. Oh no, but we can't knock him out because we weldered. Never mind. Ooh, I'm stupid. Never mind. Okay, actually, it's not the end of the world. That we did just stamp the two. I what? Rip in the chat. <laughs> Is it game over though? It might be. We have no. Do we have any way to put cards? I don't think we have a way to put cards back in the deck. 
I actually think we maybe we shouldn't have weldered that, but we had to build up this thing, right? No, we shouldn't have weldered. I completely forgot we can't do double supporter. Okay, as long as they don't have another welder here, we should be fine. We can knock them out. We just... Ah, uh, we don't have a way to put stuff back in the deck. Yeah, there's literally no way to put cards back in the deck. We just lose. Okay, so I kind of threw the game. Kind of. Oh, they got the Charizard down. Yikes. I can find them a welder. Yeah. I thought this was winnable, but I guess we should have... Yeah, I guess we should have just set up a better welder play then. You know what? I'm still going to keep this. Even if I maybe didn't play that well in the end here, I'm still going to keep this game because this was still a very epic match, guys. It was Charizard versus Charizard versus Charizard. It's, it's the Charizard Wars, bro. How can I not keep this game in the video, bro? How could I not? All right. Yeah. Um, can't think of... I, I guess they could... I mean, hopefully they stamp us. Well, as long as they don't attack, I mean, even if they don't knock us out, we still lose. I shouldn't have weldered, but I had to, but I could have saved it for last turn. I could have saved the welder, so I shouldn't have weldered. That was just stupid. I just forgot we can't play Leon and Welder in the same turn. Don't know why I thought that, but I did. Mm, yeah, it's going to cost us. So I threw the game by playing welder. All right, rip. They did Yeah, we could have won the game if I didn't do welder. No, dude, what am I doing? So do I have anything I can do? There's no calm. I shouldn't have weldered. Or sh yeah, I shouldn't have weldered. I just didn't think of the consequences. That's uh, going to be game over. Nothing I can do, right? Just making sure. There's no, yeah, there's no way to put cards back in my deck. Okay, so I misplayed. Shouldn't have played the welder. Ah, we had a, we had a pretty good chance of winning thanks to that stamped one, but... I threw... I threw, I threw, and that's my bad. I don't think, did I have anything in the, nothing was prized, right? Yeah, there's nothing in the prize that could have helped me out. So we just, I just shouldn't have weldered there. Rip. All right, you know what? Still very close game. If I didn't welder, I think we actually would have won because we would have went, stamped the two, hit them for 250. They would not have attacked. They would knock them out, and then we just had the break start. So I just shouldn't have weldered. That was just my fault. I should have saved the welder for the last minute. I don't know why I did that. I just forgot we can't do Leon and welder in the same turn, and that was what cost me the game. I was like, we need to find Leon here. And I was like, oh, we can't welder for it. So I'm still going to keep this game, bro. We were playing against a very cool deck. We're playing against another Charizard deck. How can I not keep the dual Charizard match in the video? <laughs> All right. I, that was a warm-up game. That was a warm-up game. That was a warm-up game. Hello, guys. That was a warm-up game. Now we should maybe play Ornate Rod in this deck. But decking out isn't, like, always going to happen. All right, guys. Get another game. Looks like we're playing against another welder deck. We've been hitting welder decks left, right, and center today, which is quite interesting to say the least. So we'll have to see how we do against this Welder deck and if we can beat a Welder deck this time. Yeah, I just gotta be more awake and not misplay and we should be chilling, right? You know, easy peasy. Easiest dub ever. All right, let's see here what we get in our opening hand. Uh, a Lone Charmander. Not a bad start though. We got Welder, Quick Ball. We can probably get Volk. Well, I want to go Volk and I want to go Breaksard. I think I get Breaksard with the Quick Ball. We want to, like, build up a Breaksard. Breaksard is always the opener, so that we can close the game with Charizard. Depending on what Welder deck we're playing against. It could be Sunscorch. Sunscorch is fine, because we can two-shot it with Breaksard. Okay, they got a Jirachi. Their hand is pretty big, but fine. Again, I'm hoping they're a Welder deck that doesn't play Marnie. Like, Welder decks playing Marnie shouldn't be a thing, because well Marnie is a terrible card for Welder decks, because it hurts the deck. I, I don't understand why people put Marnie in their Welder decks. It's a bad card, so... Hopefully they don't play Marnie. That's the only problem with the ladder. The ladder on this game, you can't really tell what people will have in their decks. <laughs> the ladder, the ladder is more of less the Wild West as opposed to like an online tournament. If I were to bring this to an online tournament, I would know if they had Marnie or not. Okay, they have a switch. We'll see if this is Senescorch or not. Starting from the Jirachi, it's probably Senescorch, I'm guessing, which we can beat. It could be another Charizard deck. We might just be hitting nothing but Charizard today. Who knows? What do I want to quick ball away though? Our top deck, probably. I could get rid of the Switch, but I might need it for Charmander next turn. Yeah, it's a Santa Scorch deck. All right, we can beat Santa Scorch. We can beat him. It's possible. All right. So I think we're going to Quick Ball Break. Sorry. We could get rid of the Charizard, actually. I don't mind that. Let's see what we top deck. Boss. Perfect. Perfect discard. All right, we'll get the Break Sard. I guess, you know what? Yeah, you know, we'll get rid of the Charizard. That's fine. We can win the game with 
with three of them. It's not that big of a deal. She still breaks our two, so it's not that big of a deal. So we're going to weld her to the Charizard. We could even do Collect here, which uh, might not be terrible, depending on what we draw. Got, got the Leon. We didn't get another Energy. So I th actually, we're just going to have to attach. We didn't get another Welder, so we're just going to have to attach and pass. Yeah, it's fine. We just got to hope they don't play uh, the big boy. What is the big boy again? Uh, Marnie. What the big boy? Marnie's a girl. Ah, well, hopefully they don't play ball. Marnie in this hand's actually not bad. This hand's kind of bad. Kind of. We have a switch, though. But uh, we'll see what we do here. I do want... I guess we want to hit the center score. So I actually wouldn't mind. Maybe we should have kept the boss. Hmm, but they might not get my Charmander, right? We'll see. We'll see what they do. They could not get the Charmander, but maybe we should have actually kept the boss. But I, there's something else to get rid of. I want to keep the switch, so... Yeah, we probably could have kept the boss. We could try to get an Eldegoss, though. Oh, that's our top deck. We can't use Welder Eldegoss. I don't know. I do want to get the first hit on the Center Scorch. I think that is pretty important. Um, we can still one-shot it. It's 320 HP. We just go three Leon, play the Leon from our hand, and then we knock him out Charizard. It's not that power. It's not that hard to do. You saw in the last game. Ooh. But this is fine. They're going to knock me out. Oh, they are going to set up a potential knock out of my Breaks are, though, which is kind of scary. 160. Yeah, Breaks Art could be a goner here. Alright, we'll see. We draw. We, get, we gotta pray we draw something good. Welder? That's a pretty good draw if you ask me. We can Welder here. We well, could have played the gear, I guess. Alright, we got the Quick Ball. Perfect. We got the Charmander. Oh, I guess we could. Actually, does Daddy change work two? Hmm. I actually think doing Daddy Change here might be the better play. Yeah, I'm going to go Daddy Change. Just get a new hand. Yeah, I'm just going to try to get a new hand here. That's... Yeah, I'm just going to get a new hand. It's fine. Uh, there we go. Worked out fine. Got a Leon in the discard. Get a Charmander. Do we want to play the Crobat? We can play this. Attach the energy. We still have another Crystal, so... Oh, Gucci. We can bench the Breaks Art? Nah, I don't want to give my opponent a boss win. I'm just going to bench this. Uh, we didn't get my boy. What's my boy again? I don't know what my boy is. Another Charmander. All right, well, just Brilliant Flare. Make them have to knock me out. They have a big hand. They probably have the knockout. So we'll go for... So we have to try to knock them out. So we're down two Leon. So we go Charizard. Because we have our candy. We get Leon. No, we prized a Leon. No. I guess we can still knock him out. We don't, we don't actually need to do full damage. I'll still take the Leon, though, to set up the KO. I'll take another Charmander. Oh, I didn't realize we uh, prized that Leon. It's not the end of the world. They're, we already hit them. So now they have the knock me out. They have a massive hand, so there's a very good chance they Welder here. Uh, which is a little unfortunate, but if they don't knock me out, we knock them out, which is huge. But they're probably going to get knocked out. It's not, that, it's not that hard. Okay, they're going to stand me. That's fine. Still six cards. Not that big of a deal. We don't have to den or crowbat anymore. We still got the rare candy, though. We got a air balloon, which is good. We can maybe go Volk. See if they have the Welder. Their hand is huge. There's no way they don't have a Welder. They could even Eldegoss. So, yeah, they definitely have it. I think it's three energy, right? Yep, there's the Welder. That's 160. So that's 200, 240. They need to attach an energy here to knock me out, which they definitely have. How much, how much HP do they have again? 140? So we have to go Charizard here. I don't know if we're going to get it, to be honest. Oh, they don't have it? They have to change their entire hand away? Holy crap. That's insane. They didn't lose too much, though. I guess they don't have two stamps, which is good, but... Wow, I can't believe they actually had to Dede change their hand away. I mean, they still hit it. It's like, bruh. Ah, oh, they got the Senna Scorch, too, rip. They're gonna gear for a welder, too. You hate to see it. I guess Senna Scorch can't one-shot me. It only has 160, though, on my Charizard, so it's not that big of a deal. We actually have enough HP to take a hit. Don't know if they play Goon or not. This is kind of bad. If we don't get a Charizard here, we, we're we going to be in trouble. They might, might, I mean, they don't have a boss yet. They did lose a boss, so... Unless they have an Eldegoss. They just took half their prizes, though. Ugh, they're one boss away from winning on to Denier or something. We'll see what we get. Get rid of the candy, I guess. Sure. 
If only we could knock on this. All right, here we go. Welder. Will we find what we're looking for? We do indeed. All right, now we got another Charmander, which is good too. Again, they can't one-shot Charizard. And they can't... They're da Oh, they, they lost a Great Catcher, right? Okay, so they can't win. I don't think they play any more than two Great Catchers. Do we want to play our ability? What's left in the deck? Honestly, I don't think it's worth it to do. They're out of reset, Sam. So I actually don't think we have to play the ability here. How many energy do we have left? We have still have a lot, right? We can attach. We have to attach because we have to set up the Leon play. So we have to hope to get Leon off the prizes. We have a chance of winning next turn. Because then we can knock out the Center Scorch of in one hit. Assuming they go. We have the boss in our hands. So we can always chase it. Charmander, not good. Come on, Leon. Eh, I'll take it. Leon? No, we didn't get Leon. We can't one-shot them. We can still two-shot them, though, because they can't one-shot my Charizard. They are down two Center Scorch. They might not even have it. They're down, I think, two comms? Three comms. There's, okay, so they don't have the ZB Max in their hand. Then they can't attack. And I guess maybe they don't, because they didn't promote Jirachi, which is kind of interesting. There's the boss. Uh-oh. So we actually just lose next turn, then, because they just win with boss. Ah, uh, no, bro. Not like this. Unless they whip the Sun of Scorch. They have to whip the VMAX here, because then we can knock him out. Come on, whip the VMAX. Whiff it, whiff it. Unless they play three reset stand, which I... Uh, no, there's no way. The only way they could win is they go VMAX, attach, Great Catcher, but they don't have Great Catcher, because I don't think they play any more than just one. If they could raid and heat me. That's not going to matter, right? We still knock him out with the... Maybe they don't think... Maybe they don't think I have the last Leon in my hand. I don't know. We'll see. Come on. No VMAX. One time. 60. They, they have one left. They play three comms. I know their hand is huge, but still, like, with only one in the deck, that's still pretty unlikely. Ah, dude, don't have it. No. Let's go. That should be game over then, because we knock him out, and we're chilling. So we just go boom. Play the Leon. That's going to be that. We're going to knock him out, and uh, that should be it. I don't think they can win now, because they, they can't do well their boss in the same turn. Can we finally get this last Leon? Wow, last prize was Leon. Look at that. And that's going to be another game with the deck. All right, I played a lot better that game. Um, yeah, there we go. feel like a bit more awake now. Coffee's in my system. I mean, I don't mind playing against Welder decks. I don't have to worry about Marnie, so it's nice to see. All right, guys, let's try out this deck here one more time. Uh, we'll see how we do. We go... First or second? Ugh. I'm gonna go second. So we go turn on welder. Going first isn't bad. We have that Volcanian in the deck though, which we get a Dedane star, which is pretty annoying. But we do have a Break Star play here, so it's all Gucci. Not the ideal star you want. Let's see what we're playing against here. Ooh, we're playing against everyone's favorite ADP. ADP, yes ADP, bro. Fun time, and we get a Dedane star. Even better, bro. Even better. All right, what's we getting? Charmander, cool beans. We can beat ADP. Maybe actually we go all in with Charizard. No, that seems bad. Okay, Mawile is good. That could be a great catcher target, actually. Oh, uh, yeah. Can we beat ADP? I don't know. The only, I mean, if they don't Altercation me on the second turn, we might have a shot of winning the game. I don't know why Pokemon had to give ADP the most overpowered attack ever printed for two energy. Imagine that. Two energy for the most insane attack. But if they don't get an ADP or Zacian down here, I'm feeling pretty good. Yes, let's go. That's what we need. We needed a turn to get this going. Honestly, now going Breaks Art doesn't sound like a bad idea, considering they didn't get much. I know they play Marnie, but I think Breaks Art is still really good here, as long as they don't play Vitality Band or anything. I can't remember what they mulligan for. Maybe they had in the mulligan. Don't know for sure, though. Didn't really get that great of a hand there off of that Welder. I was hoping for an Energy or another Welder so we can try to move into the, to the Breaks Art next turn. They could Marnie me, though. There's ADP. They're one turn short, though, so... We get another turn, which is good. Unless they play Crushing Hammer. If they play Crushing Hammer, I mean, I don't know what to tell you, bro. If they got Hammers, bro, like, get out of here. Get out of here. I don't know. I don't really want to rant about ADP every video, but every time I play against it, this card just triggers me. Every time I see it, bro, it just, it just sets off something in my brain that's like... Okay, yeah, no AC this turn, so that's good. They still don't have anything. No Marnie, though, which kind of sucks. Yeah. We're not gonna be able to do Break Sard, which is kind of annoying... Thank you, Dedene, for being my opening Pokemon. I really appreciate it. I'm going to get rid of the Charmander. I don't want to bench too many things in case I'm Mawile. I don't know. I, maybe I'm being a little too overcautious. I don't really know. I'm going to attach the Breaks on Pass. I'm not going to attach to Dedene because they could, like, theoretically, they could boss Charmander. Then I, 
And I'm like, well, still can't do Break Sword unless we draw Welder or Bear Balloon, which or Switch. But I think I just attached to uh, the Break Sword. Let's play it safe. If they whiff Altercation here, we're feeling pretty good. Uh, they got the Quick Ball. So they got the Altercation off before we got an attack on them, which is what I was worried about happening. Because in this matchup, you want to get the first attack on the ADP. That's not good. Yeah, there's Zacian. If they don't get Altercation here, I'm feeling good. But at the same time, unless we draw a boss, it's not still feeling pretty good. We'll see what they do. Are they just getting Trepid Sword? I think they are. They didn't get a Dedene there. No, they got a Research Rip. Well, ooh. Wait, why would they not switch? Did they attach? They did. They play. Okay, so they attach energy from their hand. So they actually can't Altercation this turn. Okay, so we're gonna get a free. Okay, this is huge. We're gonna get the free. We're gonna get the knockout, which is huge. We're gonna be able to get a prize. That's good. All right. The only problem is we can't hit the ADP or knock out the Zacian. If we can draw a boss here, that would be absolutely amazing. Ooh, what are they? Gonna, are they gonna quick ball for a Dedene? But it's too. They can't do Altercation. They've already attached. Now they got another draw chat. Right, cool. This is good. We buying time against ADP is what we want to see. Buying time is what we want to see. Got a net? What are they digging for? I don't really want to knock out the draw chief. I'm be honest with you. I'm not really trying to KO draw chief. I'm trying to get a hit on the ADP. I don't think they're going to go into the ADP though. But I mean, if they want to switch in that ADP, bro, pff, be my guess. No, some trap sword. All right. As long as they don't play Vitality Band or Leon or Goon, Breaksart shouldn't get knocked out. So, I'm hoping. There's a quick boss. We can go Crobat here finally. So that means we can try to dig for boss, which is pretty exciting. We could also just weld it with Eldegoss and get Great Catcher. But I think we definitely Crobat. I'm gonna get rid of the candy. I know, I know. Actually, no, we should have kept that. No, we should have kept the rare candy. We should have got rid of the fire crystal, actually, because we can we can get Charizard and that can get us toward boss. Oh, that was a misplay. And we got the No! <laughs> Why did I do that? No! Why did I do that? That was so silly. Okay, we can still get Great Catcher. I don't know. I should have kept... I don't know why did I not get rid of the giant... I should have got rid of the crystal, bro. What am I doing? Oh, let's go, bro. Never punish, bro. Get bodied. Get bodied, ADP. Never punish, bro. We can stamp them, too. But we can stamp the two, though, when they knock me out. I think that's actually a lot stronger than just playing it now. So let's just brilliant flare them. Beautiful. So we know they play Marnie, so we gotta be a little careful what we grab. I'm actually gonna get Charmeleon. Uh, I'm gonna get a bunch of just bad cards we don't care for. Boss... Probably just Leon, right? Oh, we need one Leon on the discard to knock them out. I definitely want to just get dead cards here, but at least some cards that can help us. So Charmeleon, if they don't mind me, we can still get the Charmeleon in play. I don't want to get rare candy. Yeah, I think we just get Leon boss Charmeleon. So in case they switch into draw and they don't have the energy here, we can boss this back up maybe. Whatever, I'll just get this. Cool, that great catcher tech. And I was actually thinking of cutting this. It just saved our lives. It, it's going to allow us to win this game now because we're going to be able to knock out the ADP. They actually get rid of a Marnie. Wait, what? Are they not going to Marnie me? Yo, maybe maybe their thought process is they know that I grabbed cards that might not be very good. So, oh, they got Berserker. No, dude. Why not the Berserker? No. <laughs> That's so bad. Now they one-shot me. Oh, my God. Actually, maybe we knock out the Zacian then. Malwana. Oh, sh it's, oh no, dude. Well, no, actually, it's fine. We can still knock him out Charizard. This is why I grab Bob. Actually, might not be able to attack me here. How much HP do they have? I mean, we can still attack with Charizard. This is okay. This definitely gives me incentive to boss this Asian. Yeah, I think I'm gonna boss this Asian then. Oh, they got the switch, bro. I was gonna be like, no, get punished. Yeah, I think I'm gonna boss this Asian here, knock it out. <laughs> Unless we can get the nuts, I don't think we're gonna get the nuts. Ooh, maybe. No, we didn't get a boss. Leon, 10 damage short, bro. Feels bad. Yeah, we're gonna boss the uh, Zacian here. Yeah. Let's boss a little Zacian. Seems good to me. Alright. Boom, boom. I could air balloon the Charizard because I can't one-shot me. I'm actually going to do that because I can't one-shot my Charizard. Yeah, boss knockout Zacian. I'll hold the energy in case they 
boss. Well, they could. I guess it's going to be boss mode terrain no matter what. We could also just lose to literally two boss here, but they have a three card hand. They have a Jirachi with like four switches down. Pretty low chance they actually can combo a, an attack here. I'm going to hold the hand though, just in case. I can play the energy. We're just going to knock him out. Take some stuff I don't care for. Actually, they might not even Marnie me. They got rid of a Marnie in that last hand. I think I just get cards that are important. We can get like... I'm gonna take rare candy. I don't know. No, I don't want rare candy. I'm gonna take. I don't wanna take a Leon, because we might need it for next turn to knock out the ADP with Charizard. I'm actually gonna not take Leon. I'm gonna take Welder. Welder. I'm gonna keep the Charizard there. I'm gonna take Volk, Welder, and Switch. All cards I don't really care about if I lose. Yeah, sure. Because next turn, we're going to have to try to go for a knockout on the ADP with Leon. I'm not going to take any Leon, because if they Marnie me and the Leon go to the bottom... Yeah, well, we have a Leon in the prizes, so yeah, and we get it, alright, so it kind of pays off. We're going to have to try to knock out ADP with Charizard next turn, because this is why I have Bossization, and now they can't one-shot me this turn. They could still get a boss, but, like, they have a three-card hand. They're down four-switch. They also need an energy. We have a giant hearth in place, so they need, like, energy, boss, switch with a four-card hand. No way. That's the... They get their last switch off Stellar Wish. Yo, if they knock out Batter to Dene, I'm actually done. I guess, like, we can still play our bench away so they don't knock me out with Mawile, but they can always build up another Zacian. We have Reset Stamp, though, right? So, it's, But they could Marnie me this turn. Oh, no. Dude, if they knock out one of my three prizers here, I'm actually done. I don't think they are. Yeah, they just play the Berserker. All right, we're chilling. We're chilling. If they don't have an energy here, this is definitely game over. Um, we'll see what they got. Yeah, the Berserker is pretty bad, but why we knock out the Zacian before it becomes a threat? All right. Okay, they had a Marnie. F in the chat. Uh, no, they have the nuts, bro. Well, they don't switch now, right? The switch is no longer there. Let me get the Leon. We didn't get the Charizard, though. Shoot. That's why I didn't grab a Charizard with that uh, with that Brilliant Flare. We can still hit them with Brilliant Flare. They have 10 HP remaining. We have a boss, though, so we can just boss them all well, I guess, and knock it out. That works, too. Okay. Yo, if you Stellar Wish into Zacian Switch, I'm done. I'm actually done if they got the Switch here. They have three nets left. Hey, did they whiff it? If they whiffed it, we definitely just boss them all wild. Let's go. We could knock him out, actually. We draw Charizard. We did not draw Charizard. Okay, so here's what we do. We go... Boss. Knock out Mawile. Then we just win the game if they ever go. But I want to knock out the ADP. But all we have to do is go Giant Hearth. Attach. Boss. And attack. It does feel bad, though, that this thing can take a hit from Breaksard. Um, if only Leon could push us above there. Uh, they might Marty me again, so we're just going to continue taking cards we don't care for. I'm definitely going to take the Stamp, just in case. I'll take Welder. No, I don't want to take any draw spores. We can take Leon now, because we have two Leon on the discard. Well, they could play Big Charm, right? Big Charm give them 250 HP. Yeah. I think we take... Let's take some stuff I don't care for. We're taking Energy... We'll take one Charizard just in case. They can't. They still can't one-shot me, so we can still attack with Breakstar if we really have to. So I'll still take a Charizard just in case. In case they don't Marnie me. They have a three-card hand. Oh, never mind. We got Charizard the prizes. We got another... Oh my god, bro. I shouldn't have grabbed Charizard. I forgot we had Charizard prize. Whatever. Who cares? Kek W. <gasps> yeah, there's a Zacian coming down finally. They can Ultimate Ray me, and as long as they don't Marnie or Stamp me here, this should be game over. And if they do that, we can also just get Charizard in play. We have, to, but now that we have three Zards, even a, a stamp here gives us more outs to Charizard. And that's not a Marty, so that will be game. We are gonna be able to knock out this. We could also just boss the Zacian with the uh, with Breakstar if you want to. They could play a stamp though, so it's not over yet. They could have a reset stamp. They actually didn't promote Jirachi, which is quite interesting, considering they didn't have a research. They could have maybe found the uh, switch out. Okay, good thing that's not a chaotic swell. That Viridian is really helpful because that does give us an energy out in case we do get a stamp. They had a net. I don't know why they didn't... Net. Yeah, they should have promoted Jirachi there. They should have promoted... Because they probably would have found the switch out, right? So... It's a good thing they didn't. But yeah, we're going to see the ultimate ray hit me for 180. And we're going to knock out the Zacian. Or we can just win with Charizard. It doesn't matter. So it feels good to beat ADP. This is what we need against ADP. The only way to beat this matchup is that we just got to pop off quick enough. If Breaksard can hit the ADP before the ultimate ray us, it's really good. Oh, they do have a big charm. Oh, shoot. 
So yeah, I'm glad I didn't grab the Leons because we probably need it now because they do play Big Charm. But if they have a reset stamp, it doesn't matter. We have we have boss for game. I'm gonna save Marnie. Oh, they have a great catcher. They can do their little boss boss combo. They actually haven't even played a boss yet. That's fine. Still game over. As long as we have boss. Unless that's stamp. Nope, that's not a stamp. Actually, I guess that if that was a stamp, they could have won the game. Which is kind of scary, considering we're like, we kind of checkmated them, but they still could have won the game if they had a stamp in hand. Because ADP is just so overpowered. They got one energy left. I guess they still have saucer, but it's going to be game over. We just promote Charizard here. We can just try to win with Charizard. Who cares, bro? Good old beaten ADP. It feels good to give this atrocious deck a beatdown. Let's see if we can get Leon A. We can just play it. Knock out. And that's game. Take it. Take it, ADP. And that'll be it for today's piece of video, guys, on the Charizard Breaks our deck. Um, I think I have enough to buy a pack from the shop, so I'm going to buy a quick pack here to end off the video. Now, after recording this, I do think we maybe want to play a couple Pokecoms. I kind of forgot about that card. <laughs> Probably want to put a couple Pokecoms in this deck. But other than that, yeah, this deck was pretty fun to play. It was actually pretty good when you actually get set up with the Breaks Um... That's that. We beat an ADP deck, which feels pretty good. It's always good to beat ADP. So let's see if we can get a Reverse Hollow DC in this pack. Or Reverse Hollow Switch. Oh, let's go, dude. Reverse Rainbow. That is good. That's not DC, but you know what? Rainbow Reverse Hollow is still amazing to have. I will take it. Let's go. That's a great way to end off the video, guys. Hope you guys enjoyed today's PDCGO video. If you guys enjoyed today's video, make sure to leave a like on the video. Subscribe down below if you're new to the channel. Help me on the road to reaching uh, 10,000 subs. Or 13,000 subs. I don't know why I said 10,000. 13,000 subs. We're actually very close. That'll be it for the video, guys, on the deck. Again, some changes I would definitely make would be probably cut a Charmeleon. Uh, maybe cut an Air Balloon and put some comms in. But, yeah. Other than that, guys, this deck, pretty fun to play. And, again, not a bad deck if it sets up. This is definitely what I would do to change up the deck. I definitely want to keep that Great Catcher. Great Catcher literally MVP'd us there. We could maybe cut a boss from the deck. We go, like, one boss, one Great Catcher. That's not a bad option either. But anyway, that's be guys. Hope you guys enjoyed, and I'll see you guys on the Peach Show video tomorrow. Follow me on Twitter down below too, by the way. Help me reach a thousand followers. I'm very close. Anyways, that'll be it. Bye bye.